Hi, this video is for those preparing for CAT 24 and they're beginning from August 24. This is focused on the CONT section, how to go about preparing for CONT and what you need to do. We do have short courses. Uh, my name, I've been training students for CAT for more than 20 years. A is different exams, are so fairly comfortable with different pattern of the exams. So we do have short courses right from focus on DLR, focus on maths to give you ample practice for the exam and a more broader mentorship course which is for individual guidance and mocks. Uh, the preparation schedule basically. Uh, the whole idea is to complete your syllabus in 50 days time. So you have two months time for practice and mocks. I mean four months is ample time to prepare for CAT. You have enough time to crack the CAT while you plan properly and go ahead properly. We will come up with more videos that will help you with regards to preparation and planning. But let's start saying that you need to complete your syllabus in 50 days. So first round, August to September, 50 days, you complete the syllabus. Your time should be around 2 to 4 hours a day for mathematics. If you have more time, give 4 hours a day. If you don't have time, 2 hours. But that's what you need to give for CAD preparation. Now, I've given number of days per topic. That's roughly the number of topics which are there. For example, if I say average is 2 days. So in two days, take up a few sums of averages. You have four, four, eight hours almost. Practice a few questions of averages. Go to the theory and then solve. I mean, don't go into too tough sums or don't take too much time on individual sums. The idea is to familiar with a topic, familiar with different type of questions that come, okay, so that you at least know how to solve. There are some subtopics which are there like weighted average, uh, change in average and so on. Understand those allegations, etc. Understand those subtopics so that you're familiar with a topic as far as possible. Right? So, two days is sufficient to cover average, I mean, two days is sufficient to cover percentage. Don't go into too much of depth of it, focus on trying to practice sums and enough of it. Right? Uh, don't take more than three days for any particular topic. The idea is right now to complete the syllabus. Because at a later stage when you go to the mocks, you may decide that you want to leave a few topics for options or you may find some topic difficult. Then we can prioritize things as to what to solve, what not to solve. But right now, Time is to familiarize with the whole syllabus. So go to the syllabus, solve a few sums for each topic so that you are comfortable with the topics. So this is a rough syllabus, what you need to cover in 50 days time. So take a few sums, so normally I say that before you go to the theory, solve a few sums so that you can solve on your own, develop the thinking habit. But anyway, go to the theory. Okay, Once you go to the theory, solve a few basic sums. And that should be enough in terms of trying to go to a particular topic. Don't try to master a topic. It will be difficult to master a topic. And I'm sure you'll always feel that, oh, I'm, what I'm doing is not sufficient. That's perfectly all right. Right now, your focus should be to complete a syllabus. Even if you feel you're not comfortable with a topic, then come back to it later on when you're doing the walks. Right now, just familiar with the basic sums as such. Because if you take too much time on this, then you will not have enough time for mocks and strategy building, which is important part and you will require time at that point. Also, there is a calculation, you can practice calculation 10-15 minutes, it helps to improve your speed. CAT has a calculator, online calculator, but other exams don't have an online calculator. Even in CAT, if you don't use an online calculator for at least simple calculations, it is preferred because you save time and therefore you can solve more subs. So try doing this. We do have courses for different MBA entrance examinations. We will come up with videos. This video is a part of four video series which talks about general cont in DLR and verbal. So part of our series, you can look at the other videos and we'll come up with more videos to help you with regards to planning your preparation and in your preparation. Thank you.